Hi, welcome again to Inigo Side Channel, and today we'll be taking a closer look at I think one of the best uh, diecast action figures right now, the Jada Metals diecast, and uh, this one in, in particular is from their Power Rangers line, and this is the Pink uh, Ranger. So, uh, what I like about uh, Jada Metal Diecast is they have the number here of the uh, of the model. So you can you won't be lost when you are collecting uh, certain uh, lines. So this Power Ranger series from Metal Diecast has six characters and they're all four inch. The Red Ranger, this starts with the M400, the Black Ranger, the M401, the Blue Ranger, the M402, this one, the Pink Ranger, M403, the Yellow Ranger, M404, and the Green Ranger, M405. So uh, what I like about uh, these metals die cast is they are pretty heavy and uh, they are a combination of uh, metal uh, die cast and uh, plastic. Now some models are all uh, die cast but most of them have a combination of metal and plastic. So for example the uh, some models, their ha their hair is made of soft uh, rubber, so you can easily uh, move it. And uh, most uh, most of their die cast, uh, the body is uh, metal. Well, the head is made of uh, plas uh, soft plastic or rubber. So uh, these uh, these toys, I think uh, they will become big in the future. Right now, they are still uh, way below the price of uh, uh, Funko Pops. But for me, this um, Jada Metal Zykas is better because they are uh, heavier. They're made of uh, metal diecast and uh, what separates them is that uh, the uh, what you call this the uh, Funko Pops have more uh, character license compared to Jada Toys Metals diecast but overall I, I really like uh, their quality I really like uh, their box And right now they're on sale at Toys R Us, so that's why I bought a couple of them. So that's it for uh, this video. If you enjoyed this one, please uh, do like and subscribe. I'll be uh, showing uh, more. Uh, more uh, diecast models and uh, thank you again uh, please do keep on collecting have a great day as always bye